Hi everyone, my name is Kate and today I will tell you and show you how to crochet this cute bag with bow. Bows are trending right now and on Pinterest you can see everywhere bows like on sweaters, on scarves, on bags and I was inspired by this bag. It's super easy to make, even a complete beginner can make this bag, you should know only one crochet stitch. I made this bag with cotton cord, of course you can use any yarn that you like, fluffy yarn, acrylic yarn, cotton yarn, I think with fluffy yarn would be more cuter, but whatever, I think it will look great with any yarn. <laughs> I like this bag because you can wear it on your shoulder or take the bag in your hand and it will be like clutch bag or make this bag without a handle like just clutch bag and of course you can make it any size bigger or smaller so don't forget to subscribe to my channel to my Instagram like this video and let's get started for this bag I use cotton cord 4 millimeters about 200 meters and hook 6 millimeters. You can of course take any yarn that you like, for example in 100 grams, 100 meters, about 2 skeins. And please take the number of the hook that's recommended on the yarn label. Plastic needle, scissors and you can sew to your bag magnetic buttons like this. And that's all. Make a starter loop like this. And chain of 18 air loops. The number of air loops will determine the width of your bag, so you can make as many as you wish. I made my chain and this will be the width of your bag. Turn your chain to the other side like this and here we have bag loops right here. We will use them to crochet the first row. Here we have the first loop from the hook, the one on the hook doesn't count and we need to insert the hook into the second loop, but back loop, so turn your chain and insert the hook into the second back loop. Grab the yarn, pull it out and crochet two loops on the hook. Insert the hook into the next back loop. Grab the yarn, pull it out and crochet two loops on the hook. This stitch calls single crochet and we're gonna crochet all back with only single crochets. So insert the hook into the next loop, grab the yarn and crochet two loops on the hook. And crochet like this until the end of the chain. I made my first row. And this is how it looks like. At the end chain 1 and turn your work. Insert the hook into the first stitch, grab the yarn, pull it out and crochet 2 loops on the hook. Then insert the hook into the next stitch and make single crochet again. And crochet with single crochets until the end of the row. This is how it looks like two rows. At the end chain one and turn your work. Then again insert the hook into the first stitch right here and make a single crochet. Then again and so on until the end of the row. So like this we're going to crochet the rectangle up until we are able to fold the work three times. We've made with you three rows and you need to make at all 42 rows or more if you want a higher bag. If you run out of a skein get a new one. Insert the hook into the next stitch, grab new yarn, pull it out and crochet the new stitch, but hiding these tails, like this. And continue crocheting. I made 42 rows and this is how it looks like and now fold 14 rows like this and then upper part like this. It should cover the entire bottom part. 
and all we need to do right now is to sew the sides with a needle. But let's finish the row, chain 1 and you can cut the yarn and then pull out the loop. So take the needle and new thread and sew the sides like this. And the ends of this yarn hide through the stitches, maybe make some knots. From the other side make the same way and all ends hide through the stitches. And right now you can sew the magnetic buttons on the corners or in the middle. For the bow we need to count the number of rows on the upper part and this is how wide we're gonna make the bow. Take the new thread and leave a longer tip so with it we could sew the bow to the back. Make a chain of air loops at the same number as we did on the back, in my case it's 18. Turn your chain and insert the hook into the second back loop of the chain and make a single crochet. And crochet with single crochets like we did on the back. We need to crochet 12 rows like we crocheted our back with single crochets. In my case it's 12 rows, in your case it could be another number. It depends on the upper part of the back how many rows you have there. This is my rectangle, at the end I made chain 1 and right now I can cut the yarn and pull out the loop. But leave a longer tip so with it we can sew the bow from the other side. And we just need to make the center of the bow and it's with single crochet too. Make chain of 4. Insert the hook into the second back loop and make single crochet and crochet with single crochets as we did on the backs, just 10 rows at all. The ends of the middle of the bow must meet with tension. At the end chain 1, cut the yarn and pull out the loop. Sew the ends with the needle. The ends hide through stitches. And now we need to sew the bow to the back. Count 14 rows from the bottom and insert the needle into this row. And just sew it like this. And the end hide through the stitches. From the other side sew the same way. And 
the clutch back is ready, I like to take it like this. But if you want to make a handle, it's super easy to make too, so let's do it. To make a handle, make a chain of 5 air loops or as many air loops as you want. And crochet with single crochets, like we did, as many rows as you want, the desired length of the handle. The length of my handle is 62 cm. And right now, with a needle, sew the handle to the back. And so this is how a cute bag looks like. You see, it's super easy. You don't need to know thousands of crochet stitches, just one single crochet. And knowing only one crochet stitch, you can make a masterpiece. I'm sure you did it well. Make it with any type of yarn that you like. Tag me on my Instagram. I will repost your bag in my stories. So I thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, to my Instagram like this video and share this video with your friends who may like this bag and see you in the next video bye kitties